Alright, y'all are in for a treat. It's still too wet to bring a truck in here. We had a big rain there yesterday. And so, Derek just cut this big oak down. Kevin's sitting right here behind me. And uh, what I'm fixing to do is I'm fixing to work the top of this thing out of this with my grapple saw here is what I'm fixing to do. So, I'm going to let y'all ride along with me as I work this top real quick. And you see what I'm doing right here now is the first thing I'm doing, I'm going to work these lens out. Because I want these limbs for pulp wood. That's what I want. A lot of y'all probably thinking, my God, really? That's right. Really. That's correct. That's how I roll, man. Get everything I can get out of that tree. See, now I got that limb right there. So I'll take and, uh, where I'm going to hit it at right there. Hit it right here. Let's go up here now. You can take that grapple saw. This ought to be a good advertisement for Rotobank, man. Look at that. Look at that. All right, now, all right, so that limb is just about done. I'm going to go back here and I'm going to cut it right here. Cut into it right there, and then I'll take my grapple in. There's still a good bit of weight in it, so I'll just pop it loose right there. All right, that's about 800 pounds stick of uh, hardwood pulp wood right there, so I'm gonna stack it right there. We still got quite a few limbs left in this tree, my friend. Quite a few limbs left in it to uh, to do that with. I'll get this one. Cut it out. Get my track set. That's one thing about the track machine, especially a high rise cab like this right here. When I'm sitting, the guy on these heels, you got to get where you can see your tracks. So work this out. You'll start at the end, get the weight out of the uh, out of the off the limb. That's the key to working these limbs out. See all that weight's gone off that one right there now. All right, I'm gonna come back right over here cut back into it right here again. You always want to be, if you can, see how just touch that thing, let that limb let that limb gently fall. I got it almost cut all the way off. And I pick it up like that. It's out. Alright. Now I got this one more limb over here. I need to get off and roll it. Now that's a good stick of pulp wood right there. That's a really good stick. So I get this thing over here. Get that. I may even say that save that that gun fork right there out of that thing. Alright, get off there. pieces. I'll put that in my pile. I have to lean up where I see around that boom. That's one thing that changed on the new machines that they're, that they're building. Made it where you can see a lot better out of them. Alright. Now let's see what I want to do now. So we've got a lot of top left here on this joker. Just tear that limb out. Get it out of the way. I'm not going to use that one. I'll go ahead and rip this one out. Two. There we go. Gone. Go up here. This in here is going to be a little tricky because it's split. Oh, shoot. Anytime you got them ones that are split like that, they're bad. They're not good to put with. You saw it on my chain there. Alright, got that. This one up, get it free. Tear it out. Now, this limb right here out. Let's see. Get off of that. That's 
just like a chainsaw cut it out, man. All right, there's still a lot of weight right there in that tree. I'm gonna get these other two limbs here. In case you're wondering, I do talk to these trees like this when I'm when I'm working and 